Good day, Mount Moriah. Joel chapter 1 verse 12 says, Even now declares the Lord, Return to me with all your heart, with fasting and weeping and mourning. Today is Ash Wednesday. Normally we would be in combined services with Lincoln Park United Methodist Church on tonight, but unfortunately because of the pandemic we would not be able to do so. But yet and still we come to this point, this first day in Lent, I'm sure many of us with some practice that will lead us to a deeper relationship with Jesus Christ. I don't know what you are giving up for Lent. Uh, I have decided what I was giving up for Lent and it is a personal decision. And so we ask and pray uh, that you make some type of sacrifice that will draw you closer to God but we as a church community want to prepare ourselves during this 40 days for the eventual resurrection of Jesus Christ. In Joel's time, there was so much going on. The country of Israel was going through um, fires and it was going through war and it was at a point of devastation, but yet and still the Lord wanted them to, to fast. The Lord wanted them to weep and the Lord wanted them to mourn. So even during this pandemic, it is a time for us to fast. It is a time for us not to focus on what is going on in our world, but to focus on a God who can provide hope, a God who can make a way, a God who can do the impossible, and also a God who is able to give us the strength to refrain from whatever we are fasting from during these next 40 days. So I, I do encourage you to fast in, in some type of way. And I'm looking forward to hearing the miracles and wonders that God performs as a result of your fasting. So what I wanna do now is that I wanna pray for you as you begin this 40 day journey. Let us pray, Father, we do love you and we do praise you and we do magnify you and we do glorify you. And we thank you for this opportunity to participate in this Lenten season. And we ask and pray that you would give us the strength to refrain from that which you have brought to our attention that we need to make obsolete in our lives these next 40 days. We ask and pray that you would strengthen us as a result of our fasting, that you would open doors, that you would give us clarity as a result of our fasting. We realize that Satan is not happy. We bind Satan in the name of the Christ. We look forward for what you are going to do in our lives over these next 40 days. And we look forward to being better Christians come Resurrection Sunday. In the name of the Christ, we pray and give thanks. Amen. Join us on tomorrow night as we begin our seven-part Lenten revival. You should have in your email boxes already the information for our Lenten revival. And also you can join us on Facebook on Alpha Omega Chapters page. And so we look forward to you worshiping with us during this Lenten season over these next seven weeks. God bless you. May heaven smile upon you and be safe on tomorrow and Friday as we are expecting inclement weather. I love you. Take care.